Wow, it is really beautiful today in Colorado Springs. Uh, so, day whatever of the quarantine, well, sort of, I wonder uh, what we're going to do today. Oh, look, this guy or this person has, uh, what is that? Holy Bible. Huh. You don't say. Hey everybody, Zoom360 here on the go, and uh, today we are we are going to be on the go somewhat. I thought it would be fun. Um, in case if you guys have not realized, is that there is a there seems to be a shortage of toilet paper, wipes. What is the other thing? Yes, hand sanitizer. And uh, though I do have these things here with me, but I thought it would be fun for us to chase these things today. So I'm going to go to several Walmarts within the Colorado Springs area just to see if I can score some, just to see. So yeah, so uh, let's go on this wild hunt for the elusive toilet paper the mysterious hand sanitizer and the inconspicuous wipes. Let's do it. All right, let's go on the hunt for this stuff. So it is a beautiful day today though, I gotta say. Uh, it's a Tuesday. It's about the beginning of the afternoon. It's just past 2.30. Alright guys, so the first, the first store I'm actually going to go to is actually, it's, it's not Walmart, it's actually, it's a big superstore. I think it's called Louvers or Loopers. I, 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 I don't remember, but we're gonna check there too because it, it's not Walmart, but it's like a Walmart. All right, don't, don't hit the pothole. Oh my God, we should be good. We should clear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, good. Oh gosh. Yeah, it's called King Supers. Uh, this is, uh, I think this is unique to Colorado Springs. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, it's King Supers right there. So yeah, so uh, we're gonna go in there and check the shelves, you know. And maybe, maybe that we'll get lucky. Maybe that, like, they'll have a whole bunch of that stuff in there. And I guess I'll buy some if it's there. I mean, I don't have to have it now, but just saying. But um, yeah, let's go ahead and see. Uh, at two two forty one p.m. Is there any of that stuff left? As you can see, this is where they would hold, they would have the wipes, they'll be over here, but look like all the wipes are, are gone. Still gone, I guess. I don't see any wipes. Um, yeah, let's go to, to the other, ah, that's where they usually keep the TP. The infamous TP. Oh, okay. Well, this is this isn't bad here. They, they still have some. I mean, yeah. I mean, it's it's not toilet paper, but it's at least it's uh paper towels. But the the bath tissue, the bath tissue is all gone. So, no wipes, no, no toilet paper at King Louvers. Let's go to Walmart, everybody's favorite, favorite store, Walmart. God, 
it is gorgeous today. The blue sky, the mountain, the sun, look at that. I like that. All right, so we just came out of King Supers and there isn't any toilet paper like the the real stuff uh the, you know tp there is none of that there aren't any wipes but there were some of paper towels which we you know you can't use it for that you can only use it just to wipe stuff off the sink and stuff like that dude and, hey those of you who are doing that because i read a couple of articles online talk about sewer systems are getting cl clogged do not flush paper towels down the toilet they don't break down the same way as regular toilet tissue paper so if you're doing that stop it all right so we are at our favorite store woohoo walmart this is the first walmart that we're gonna hit in colorado springs i think there's three more to go so we're gonna go into the grocery, grocery. Yeah, I said it right. Because I think that's where they would normally keep toilet tissue. So, yeah, let's check it out. There's the aisle. There's the paper tissue, toilet tissue aisle. Oh, it would look like we might get lucky. So it's just paper towels. Um, yeah. Is this? No, that's paper towels. So no luck here, no paper towels. Let me see if they have wipes. So this is the toilet tissue aisle and there's absolutely nothing here. So the wipes are gone, but the hand soap is there though. A lot of the stuff you use to clean your house is still available though. So this is the aisle where they would have maybe the wipes and the TP. They got some Kleenex, but uh, yeah, now that stuff is there, is here rather. All right, we're back. So no wipes, no hand sanitizer, and uh, no toilet tissue. But I'm starting to notice a trend um if i see the same thing in the next i think we have three more yeah in in the next three walmarts i'm gonna declare it a trend which i find questionable and disturbing and here we are at walmart at walmart number two um actually this one i think um I don't know the area too well, but this is the one next to Fort Carson, Colorado Springs. So uh, yeah, let's uh, check it out. So we are in the toilet tissue aisle. Uh, looking for it, I'm not seeing it. No toilet tissue, no wipes. Yeah. 
none and just like that we're back same deal so that's three stores three stores three three stores that i've been to so far no wipes no toilet paper and i keep forgetting one of the, yeah and no hand sanitizer but the same thing i noticed in the last two stores i've also noticed in this store but i'm not gonna call it a trend yet there's still two more places i'm gonna stop by and see so as the quest continues for toilet paper hand sanitizer and wipes what a time to be alive all right so this is walmart number three this one is at the edge of the city like it when you're when you're leaving colorado springs so let's go in there and see third time is the charm right so just as i was walking down the aisle for the wipes there was a shipment that came in it was almost sold out i i, I got the one before last <laughs> but yay so far so good so we so we found wipes so that's awesome yeah there's plenty of water though there's plenty of water but i got the i got the one before last of the wipes <laughs> insane all right so um we have progress i found um so i was walking down the aisle and then i saw this punk rock chick was running as fast as she could going the opposite way that i was walking so i kept on walking straight and went around into the aisle that she went into and it turns out there was a very last box of wipes and they were selling out there was this one woman she grabbed one for her and for her daughter because her daughter is in the stores to shopping that's either here nor there <laughs> but so so the guy so she took two and the punk rock chick took one and then there was two left and there were two left and then the clerk put them on the shelf and i was like eh, i'll grab one so there's well there's one left but chances are it, it's already spoken for so so far so good we started at 2 30 it's 5 30 we managed to find some wipes so that was it that well, well there's one more walmart and then i don't think i'm gonna have time to go up to castle rock but i definitely go down to pueblo just to see though i'm afraid of pueblo because i've not heard of good things about pueblo and this car draws a lot of attention i don't i depends on where where the walmart is if it's in the ghetto i could even gonna bother because <laughs> but so far so good though we got the wipes <laughs> so on the hunt for a toilet paper and hand sanitizer and see can we find it can we get lucky yep another walmart what is that walmart four this one is more like a you know it's more like a neighborhood market kind of walmart um uh, it's not per se like those superstores that sell a lot more stuff like i think over there it's mainly food and cleanliness things so i'm, I'm going to see can we score some tp and hand sanitizer <laughs> So this is the section for the TP, as you can see. It's all gone. So I guess that's it. You see, this probably wouldn't work because people would still buy one go home come back or, or have the entire family keep going in and out buying it one at a time because people are insane like that and guys there you have it oh man the sun this this shadow thing 
All right, so there you have it. Um, so there is no TP, no hand sanitizer there, and no wipes, though I already have that. Um, so I wanted to leave the springs though. I wanted to go down to Pueblo. I'm not gonna have time to go to Pueblo and then go back to the spring and then go up, go up to Castle Rock. But I want to at least leave the springs to see what's going on in Pueblo because Pueblo is a little bit smaller though I have not heard anything good about Pueblo but I am going to <laughs> once I get down to Pueblo I'm going to find the uh, Walmart in West Pueblo and uh, <laughs> go there so we are on the hunt guys we are on the hunt let's do some hunting this was a beautiful gorgeous day today it's too bad there's this stupid quarantine because I could have been somewhere cool and somewhere far right now that I really wanted to go. Ugh. Yeah, buddy. Everything. Oh, th there's some napkins. I'm not sure if we should get that, but uh, we are approaching the aisle for the paper towels. It is up there. So this will be the closest thing to it, but not quite. But I can use some napkins, uh, uh, you know, when I'm cooking. So I'm gonna go, go ahead and grab that. Ha <laughs> ha! Success. I found some bathroom tissue, not quite the brand I like. I think they had the brand I like, but they already sold it out. But uh, yeah, look at that. I had to drive to Pueblo, which is what? 30 minutes away from Colorado Springs uh, to get TP. But then again, uh, it was not in the usual place. They kept it in us. It was at the entrance in big boxes, but I don't think I noticed that in the other Walmarts, um, but I almost missed it till I was like, aha, there you are. But uh, yeah, so looks like hand sanitizer is what I'm not going to find today. Though I think we might have time to go to one more Walmart here. I'm gonna try that, but if not, it's okay because I already have some that should last me another month or something like that. I'm not hoarding, I just know how much I, I use within a month, so. Yeah, this has been successful. I didn't think I was gonna find anything at all. Yeah. All right guys, the golden hour is upon us and we are at Walmart Pueblo West, which is the nice part of town. Feels so great here. So we're gonna go in there to check for hand sanitizer because we got two out of three. So let's hope we could get three out of three. Oh boy. Wow, they had some TP left. So they don't have, uh, they didn't have hand sanitizer, but surprisingly they still had, they still had TP here. So, I mean, not a lot, but they, they still had TP, so. The golden hour is here. I need to hurry up, get back home. I'm not a fan of driving at night, especially on the highway. <laughs> the sun is setting. I'm not sure if you can see it. It looks beautiful. Time for me to head back. Ooh, IS300. I love that car. I love that car. There's a few things I gotta do to mine to get it just right for the next trip. Can't wait.
while I was driving to Pueblo on the highway, I saw a silver IS300 broke down and she was in the median. That hurts, that hurts because it's, because especially when we used to be silver at some point, but it's just, it, it pains me to see an IS300 broken down. She belongs on the road. Right, guys uh it is getting late so she's all she's she is all tucked in for the night uh as usual this is her home uh today was fun chasing down all of those items um so we got two out of three so i'm impressed so um well you guys stay safe out there uh, this thing will will pass and stay positive this is room 360 inviting you to get up get out and do it as much as you can in these times like subscribe and share and i'm out hey it's me again uh there's one thing i forgot to mention there's one thing there's a trend i noticed is that Though the wipes are gone, the toilet paper is gone, the paper towel is pretty much gone. But I noticed that the vitamins, the flu medication, soap, hand lotion, liquid soap is still plentiful. Something's not adding up because based off what we know about the coronavirus uh, hygiene seems to, seems to be seems to be important but for some reason people are buying toilet paper wipes and paper towels and they're leaving the soap the hand lotion are they substituting sanitizer for this stuff i mean the vitamins the flu meds i don't know